Jafard. How are you today? Okay, can I ask you a favor? Um, can you be my chutty for a while? Can you be my chutty? Chutty for a while. Okay, thank you. Now, what do you want to discuss? Oh, that's great. Okay, simile and <laughs> okay, <laughs> simile and metaphor. Now, to formally uh, begin our discussion, I would like to introduce myself. I am Olive Manabasi Uiko, a third year BSN student of Misamis University. Can you also introduce yourself? Yeah, sure. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good. Now, um, Simile, as you know, simile and metaphor are two of the most common types of figures of speech. Okay. <laughs> now, um, I would like to ask you if you know what is figures of speech. Uh, okay, figures of speech is something like... Like... Okay, that's great. Okay. okay. You have forgotten the meaning, but it's good to hear that you still remember what figures of speech is or are. Now, let us begin discussing simile. Okay. 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 Simile is a figure of speech that makes a comparison. It shows similarities between two things. Like, um, for example, I will give you an example, okay? For example, our soldiers are as brave as lions. I repeat, our soldiers are as brave as lions. Now, what have you noticed with the example? Uh, Okay, that's very good. Now it uses the word um, it uses the word as right? It uses the word as to describe the two different things, the lion and the soldier. Okay, is it can I, is it clear? Have you understood the definition of simile? Yeah, but I think for example Okay. We need more examples, so I will, I will give another example. Um, um, well, let me see. Okay, another example. Her chicks are like rose. I repeat, her chicks are like rose. Now again, I will ask you, what have you noticed with the other example? Yes, that's it's very good. You're right. The chick is being compared to a rose. Yes. yes, yes, yes. That's good. That's good. Now, this time, since I think you are good already with simile, we will begin discussing about metaphor. Is it okay? Okay, now... Metaphor is another figure of speech which makes an implicit, implied, or hidden comparison between two things. They are unrelated but share some common characteristics. So, in other words, simile is a comparison of two contradictory or two different things, which is based on a single or some common characteristics. Okay, Ra, have you understood? Or do you need more explanation? Yeah. I think the meaning of the word is like, uh, as, 
Okay, okay. Okay, so in simple English, when you portray a person, place, thing, or an action as being something else, even though it is not actually that something else you are speaking. Okay, I will give you an example. Um, he is the black sheep of the family. I repeat, he is the black sheep of a family is a metaphor because the the pronoun he or the the subject which is he is being compared to a black sheep when that word uh, when the pronoun he is not even a sheep or he or he is not even black um in koan saba in simple terms metaphor is just like a simile but with the absence of like and as Mararagi hapon ka og nag-compare pero wala wala siya as wala pud siya like. Ah, okay, okay. Uh-uh. Sige, I will give you another example ha. Her voice is music to his ears. Again, her voice is music to his ears. Ang voice daw niya gi-compare, ay compare ang voice daw niya is mura og music sa iyang dunggan. It implies that the voice makes the person listening happy. Although, diba, if if you think uh, her voice is be, her voice is music to his ears. Um, it is it is like kanang nag compare ka pero wala lang siya like o wala pa siya ask. Okay. Okay. Another example. My brother was boiling mad. Again, my brother was boiling mad. This implies that. The brother is too angry. Then, and then, it, it implies that the brother is very, very angry. Okay. You think I understand now? <laughs> really? You think you understand now? Okay, na? Yeah. It's about the mind. It's about the mind. Oh, sige, okay. This time, ikaw na po ang maghatag ng example. Example. Ah, oh, example. Um, sa man, hatagan ka na kung kuan second to think. Ah, uh, I think it's a problem. Oh, you already have an example. Sige, can you give an example for simile and metaphor? Metaphor. Okay, metaphor first. Go ahead. Uh, wow, that's great. Okay, what makes the sentence a metaphor? <laughs> Again? Okay, okay. You are the apple of my eye. That's a great example. How about for simile? Again? Okay, runners are fast as cheetah. Oh, you can, or you can say it, runners are as fast as cheetah. Right? Okay. Oh, so what makes the sentence a simile? Wow, I have a very, very smart student. I shoot it rather. The example, your example, both for simile and metaphor, is very, very good. I really appreciate that. Thank you for the appreciation. <laughs> well, I guess. 
I guess this ends our discussion. I thank you very, very much for your cooperation and for your time. I hope I hope you learn from our discussion. <laughs> so see you when I see you. Thank you, Far. Okay. Bye. 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 Thank you.